Hello friends, welcome again. This is Rajan. I hope you are doing great. So in the previous video, I explained to you why I trade cryptocurrency these days and also the introduction of cryptocurrency trading. Uh, please make sure to check that video and you can come back to this. In this video, I'm going to explain you how I transfer funds from Vazirix to Binance and also the reason behind why I use Binance to trade cryptocurrency and after that I will also explain you the XRP USD uh, technical analysis part is there a buying opportunity for that so please make sure to watch the entire video without skipping any part so please make sure to like this video comment if you have any doubts and also share this with your friends and also subscribe to this channel for more contents like this and also the subtitles have been added to my Tamil channel I will place the link below you can also check all the videos of my Tamil videos okay friends so first thing first let me explain you why I use Binance to trade cryptocurrency and why I use Wazirix just for transferring funds okay uh, Binance it's the largest cryptocurrency exchange in the world and apart from that it's very safe and secure in case if something goes wrong in our country uh, our cryptocurrency will be very safe in Binance and also there is a lot of benefits like you can earn interest you can also stake coins and you can trade many paths uh, when uh, when you compare it with Wazirix uh, you can trade many many uh, paths apart from whatever you get in Wazirix okay and uh, this is the main reason uh, why I trade in Binance and the reason why I choose Wazirix is because the transfer of fund from uh, Wazirix to Bitcoin is free there is no fee involved and that's the reason I'm uh, choosing uh, Wazirix okay okay so before I explain you about the XRP USD uh, technical analysis part let me explain you how to transfer funds from uh, Wazirix to uh, Binance okay so uh, this is the Wazirix uh, exchange uh, panel uh, once you transfer the fund to Wazirix from your bank account uh, you will see the fund here in INR okay uh, in order for you to transfer fund to uh, Binance you need to have USDT okay you cannot transfer fund in INR so USDT is nothing but a stable currency uh, they use it as a medium to buy the other currency okay so basically what you have to do is you just go to the exchange and you select USDT INR and you just buy and here you will see the right side you will see the uh, price the amount of USDT you are willing to buy and uh, this is a very simple uh, option that you have like let's say you have thousand US uh, sorry thousand rupees and you want to buy 25% of your INR okay so basically right now I do not have much funds here whatever I have I have already transferred it to Bitcoin so right now I have I don't know what is minus 73 uh, but let's say I have thousand rupees okay um, okay let me use 50% of whatever I have and uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to buy USDT okay let's click USDT and uh, I do not have any funds guys you need to have some funds to buy uh, USDT at least more than one I guess so let me try 100% okay even 100% <laughs> I think I have only 73 rupees so I cannot buy now so yeah let's consider that I've bought it and once the order is completed whatever INR you have here would be converted into tether so you would be able to see USDT in this particular panel so once you have USDT it's very simple you just have to go to transfer fund to Binance right at the top it's there but in order for this to uh, appear at the top first you have to go to Binance I will just provide the link below just open the link uh, in the description or in the pinned comments and uh, what you have to do is you just go to wallet and go to vanilla options here and again you just have to go to Wazirix and now since I have already linked Wazirix and Binance um, I can see this dashboard but you guys have to uh, register it's a very simple process you just have to connect and there should be some authentication and you just once you complete it you will be able to see this and once you uh, connect us sorry once you connect the Wazirx and binance uh, you should be able to see this panel guys okay and uh, once all these are done it's very simple transferring fund is very simple initially it may look like a very complicated process but 
once you uh, transfer it one or two times it's very very simple okay and then you just click was transfer of fund so we are transferring wazirx uh, fund to binance so whatever uh, we are transferring the tether usd okay and uh, you can select 100% whatever amount you want to uh, transfer you can do it and once you transfer okay it will ask for your otp you just authenticate and once it is authenticated what you have to do is you just go here and select a uh, fiat and spot you just go to wallet and then fiat and spot and then right here you would be able to see uh, the usdt right now i have uh, around a thousand eight hundred dollars worth of usdt in my binance account and uh, from here once you get once uh, the funds are being transferred into the binance account what you have to do in let's say you are buying xrp usd okay what you have to do is you just go to the market uh you just sorry uh, you just have to go to the trade and you just click advanced classic whatever you think is uh, uh, easy or whatever you think is convenient you just select whatever you want and here you go xrp usdt okay you just make sure to select the right pair xrp usdt once you select this again it's very as simple as uh, uh, the binance what you have to do you just click limit or market whatever you want and let's say you have 1000 usdt and you want to allocate 50 percent of usdt you can just select it like that since i had a 1800 and i have selected 50 percent here it is appearing 900 usdt right so it's very simple uh, very user friendly guys so you you just buy the xrp once you buy once you place the order you just have to go to the market again sorry not market where is that wallet again you just go to fiat and spot and the xrp usdt would appear here okay okay let's go into the xrp usd what's happening so in the last video i was explaining you that let me sorry let me delete this and um, okay so i was explaining you that once this is broken uh, probably i'll get a buy here when it is uh, touching this trend line but it went up it was like like this and it went above there was a breakout but it is a fake breakout right after the breakout it just fell and right now it has bottomed out here and it has also come out of the channel right uh, which is a good sign and also you can see that uh, there is a channel going on here uh, wait let me shorten this and uh, okay and i hope uh, i upload this video right before the breakout itself let's see uh, uh, so there could be a breakout now and this is kind of a bullish signal guys and again uh, this is not a call this is definitely not a call this is just for educational purpose even if you are planning to invest in this particular stock or oh sorry not stock in this particular pair cryptocurrency pair um just make sure to allocate only the amount that you are willing to lose don't put your hard-earned money don't put your entire salary in this this is just for an educational purpose i don't want people to lose money but there is some potential so i'm just uh, educating you guys so let's hope uh, uh, probably you can put your stop loss right below this uh, 1.25 and uh, let's hope for the best and if this is broken i'll definitely exit and uh, this is what i've been doing and if you guys have any doubts please let me know in the comment section i hope you find this video very useful please make sure to like this video for more contents like this your support would motivate me more to upload videos like this okay uh, so thank you so much for watching this video with patience uh, see you soon with other video